welcome to my YouTube video. This video is all about American Eagle and I'm going to be showing you guys what's in store. I'll drop everything in the description box below that I find in store, even if I don't like it because I know that sometimes you guys like things that aren't really my style. I'm really excited to see what's in store because honestly I haven't been in American Eagle in like two weeks and I know that they change out their store pretty frequently and I'm sure they're going to have a ton of winter items in there so I'm so excited. Definitely hit the subscribe button below if you guys are new because I upload videos on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays so literally three times a week and all of my videos related to fashion and lifestyle so I would love it if you guys would come back and check out my other videos and yeah give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoy it and I will see you guys inside look at all the Christmas stuff I'm so excited to see what they have in there Super cute cardigan. Hey you guys, I have a ton of stuff that I'm gonna try on today. I literally haven't been here in like two weeks and I feel like I've just pulled the entire store because honestly there's so much stuff. So I'm going to say in advance, do not mind my nail. I have a like a chip nail and I'm trying to show you guys. I have a chip nail right there and it's like literally terrible and it's driving me nuts, but I have a nail appointment in a couple days. I just tipped it today, so anyway, I'll have to deal with it um, until like two more days from now, but yeah, so um, this is what I'm wearing. I have this from um, H&M. If you guys didn't watch my H&M haul, you guys should definitely go check it out, um, and I think that this is actually sold out online, but they do have some in store, um, and then this is from Zara. This bottom is also from Zara, and then these are just my ASO shoes that I wear literally all the time. Um, so I have a ton of stuff as you guys can see behind me. Let me show you guys. I have this puffer which is different than the one I just purchased from here. The one I got before was like corduroy and this one is like slick. And then I got this really cool um, slinky type shirt and then I got this sweater which actually is a v-neck in the front but I'm gonna turn it around and see how it looks because I don't really care for v-neck sweaters then I got these super cute mom jeans that are similar to mine but they're just like a different wash they're like acid wash and then I have this really cool coat that is honestly similar to what I'm wearing right now but what I'm wearing right now is a jacket then I got this plaid shirt which is so soft it's like in their really soft amazingly soft line then i got this amazingly soft sweater as well or hoodie and i got it in a large because i want it to be oversized and then i got two pairs of skinny jeans one that's dark and then one that's light but then this one has like a raw hem on the bottom so tons of stuff today and I always walk out of here with a ton of things so we'll see what I grab. I just bought a coat from here and honestly this is out of my comfort zone a little bit but I saw Allegra Shaw wearing a blue coat like this which was crazy expensive but this one is actually pretty affordable so I'm gonna see if I like this one and this one could be a dupe to that one so let's get into it. Okay so this first coat is so cute like so cute. cute. So it's very similar to um, the jacket that I had on earlier but the other jacket is literally just a jacket like this is a coat. It's very warm and it has like this little sleekness on the inside which is really nice and it's $129.95 so it's actually really affordable for a coat I feel like because it's super warm and it's not like a jacket it's an actual coat that is just like worth this price there's a couple of buttons on the front they aren't like tortoise shell buttons but they are just like the regular um, brown buttons which I think is cute too and it matches with this and I feel like if you had tortoise shell buttons that this would look a little too much because there's already a lot going on but I would probably wear honestly with an outfit like this one um, just like a plain uh, type of look and something like very monochromatic and lots of brown um, I think that this looks really nice I do kind of wish that it were a little bit longer just because you guys know that I like a long trench but this one hits like pretty much um, almost to my knee which I think is still cute but it's just not like as long as I would want it so I don't know if I would grab this one but I did get it in a large so maybe if I sized up to an extra large it wouldn't necessarily be longer but it would be like you know that oversized look that I'm looking for so yeah this one's super cute and I really love it I feel like I would get a ton of wear out of this um, I do really like the pattern too and I feel like this is a pattern you can't really find anywhere else because it's Sherpa but it also is plaid whereas a lot of the time you can find Sherpa but you're not gonna find plaid or like vice versa so 
super cute and let's get into the next one all right so this hoodie is the next one and it is so soft like that little tag was not lying it's crazy soft i got it in a large i do wish that i could have sized up a little bit more you guys know how i am about my big baggy stuff and i would honestly love to wear this with like some biker shorts or something um but it is really cute and it's super super soft i like i said sized up to a large but i would have sized up larger and it is 44.95 so it's like a really good price um um, this one is probably one that I would grab, but I just would want to size up for sure. Um, I feel like this is something that I would wear like working from home because you guys know that I do work from home. Um, and so, yeah, it's just like really cozy, really soft. Um, you could like tuck it into the side of your pants and then just kind of like have it hang a little bit if you want it to have like more of um, a crop book or you could do this thing right here. There you go you could um like tuck it underneath your bra and then just like wear it crop like that i think that's cute too and then it just like adds a multi-purpose way to like wear the hoodie so so many ways to wear it but this one is probably how i would wear this just because it's not necessarily at not necessarily as long as i would want it to be but it still is really cute okay i love this obsessed i'm so glad that i sized up um, to a large as you guys can see my little tag right there normally I wear a medium but I wanted it to be like oversized and baggy and you guys can tell there's a lot of extra fabric I think that's just like the best way to wear plaid honestly I feel like when it's too tight on your body it just looks like I don't know it just doesn't look like comfy and casual it almost looks like you're trying to dress up or something but I feel like this looks just very casual like you could just wear this you know any day just doing anything like it doesn't look like I'm trying to dress up or anything um, I did tie it here in the front it's not normally supposed to be tied and I'll show you guys what it looks like whenever I um, take it down like at the end like right before we get to the next um, item but I got this like I said in a large and then I got these in a size 8 I wear typically between 6 and 8 um, and normally in American Eagle I wear 6s but I have been <laughs> kind of like eating my weight in holiday food and stuff like over um halloween and stuff so yeah i need to get back into my sixes but um for now these eights are good but i wear between six and eight these fit really well super cute um these are also 49.95 a very good price i really like how these don't have any distressing on the front front and i feel like they would just be a nice jean you could wear with booties or something like that they look really nice in the back too and honestly i feel like this is a really just cute vibe together i would for sure like wear this just going to like chill like not really doing much let me show you guys what it looks like with my bag because i feel like that just kind of put together the entire look um this is the bag i'd probably wear it with honestly and i think that this is just like really cute um i'd probably wear it like this or i'd wear it um just like holding the handle and i wear it like this sometimes but not all the time um this is what it looks like holding the handle and i think that's cute um so yeah this is the look and let me show you guys what it looks like untied in the front which i probably wouldn't wear it like this just because it's so oversized but if you did want to wear it like untucked or something this is what it looks like without um being tied in the front which this is still cute it just doesn't really do anything to my shape and i think it just kind of like eats me um so i probably would tie it in the front or just tuck it in the front where it just like hangs a little bit because then that way you can at least see a little bit of your shape and show people that you aren't a sack of potatoes. So yeah, okay, let's get into the next outfit. Okay, so before I like turn this video on, I did try on the sweater like the right way so it's not like backwards because this is backwards and I didn't really care for it, but I will show you guys what it looks like the regular way because it is a v-neck sweater. But I just like sweaters when they're higher neck on me. I just feel like v-necks, just aren't really flattering and you kind of just have to know your own body but I got this in an extra large and this one's $44.95 so it's really affordable but I really love the colors on it and honestly it reminds me of like I don't know the 80s or something I feel like anything that has this like orangish type rust color reminds me of the 80s for some reason but super cute glad I got an oversized look uh, I feel like that just looks best and it's just like really cute and I also love the knit pattern on the front because it's like different here and here but then 
it's like different in like different spots. Um, it's really cool. And there's also like this knitting that's like open. Um, it just looks really good. This is what it looks like untucked. If you wanted to wear it that way, I probably wouldn't just because you guys know how I am. And I feel like this is a lot with all of this, but having it tucked in, I feel like it just makes it look a little bit better. I don't know, I'm weird about tucking things in. I feel like it shows my shape better too. But I definitely will grab this one because I feel like it just looks so unique because it's backwards. I don't know, comment below if you guys think that this this looks stupid backwards. But I wear sweaters backwards a lot, honestly, because I don't like v-necks. Um, this right here is really cute. I got this in a size 8. And these are actually stretchier than the other ones. They have a lot of extra room. Um, so I probably could have went to a 6 instead of an 8. Um, try to show you guys like the room it's not like a crazy amount but there's enough where um, I can like kind of fold it over so but these I think are like super stretch so that's what they're advertised as they're $55.95 so they're really like a good jean but I think they are like 10 bucks more than the other ones um, and there is a lot of distressing on it so super cute it's also cropped to the bottom and there's distressing on the back I kind of wish that that like little um, distressing, distressing slash crop hem was on the front instead of the back because I obviously cannot see it. So yeah, let me show you guys what this looks like turned around so you guys can see if maybe you guys would want to wear it the other way. Um, and this is just how I would wear it, but maybe you guys will want to wear it a different way. I don't know. This is what it looks like turned around. Honestly, like I just feel like my shoulders are too broad. Like it just is like so wide and it's just making me look more wide. I don't know, maybe I just like have a complex about like low v-necks, I don't know. Um, maybe if it weren't extra large it wouldn't pull so far too. Um, but you can pull it like lower obviously, but I wouldn't put it too low. I did try it like off one shoulder, um, but it just kind of like pulls too much here and I would like it to like sag a little bit more if I were going to wear it off the shoulder, so I probably would just wear it up like this. Um, obviously, turn around. So yeah, okay, let me try on, so I'm going to try on that blue coat um next i'm loving this the jeans in particular the top is like meh it's okay um this i did not size up in i got in a medium because i wanted to like have it tucked into these mom jeans and this one is 49.95 and it's like a silky material it honestly reminds me of like a dad shirt which i'm vibing with i think it's cute i don't necessarily think that i would want to wear it if it were untucked like it just looks kind of like eh. um so i probably would just tuck it in and i feel like maybe if i got a large i would want to wear it untucked um but just because it's like more like tight on my arms and like just a tighter top i probably would wear it um tucked in also these jeans are like obviously very high rise so i think they just look better with a tucked in shirt um, yeah, I also love how like silky this fabric is. It's obviously not going to keep you very warm in the winter, but I think that it's just different and it's really cute. Um, I'm going to try it on with that blue coat in a minute and hopefully I like it. I literally just bought a corduroy coat in here that's the exact same puffer. It's just not like slick. Um, but if I like that one, I'm going to grab it too. I don't know how much I'd wear blue, but you never know. Um, these mom jeans, I'm ub obsessed with them. I feel like American Eagle is just like magical when it comes to jeans because these are sixes and you guys literally just saw that I tried on two eights like for skinny jeans and the eights fit fine but like there wasn't a ton of extra room and then of course I tried on mom jeans and they didn't have any eights and so I was just like I'll try on the six. I do really like the acid wash in it and I'm gonna try it on see what I think. Try it on. Freaking love them. These are so cute. I do kind of want to try on the eights um, just to see if they fit a little bit better because like this is bulging out a little bit um, and obviously I do fluctuate between a six and an eight and so like whenever I am like eating better and stuff I usually am a six and then whenever I'm like kind of being like a trash person and just like eating garbage and not like just being as um, like working hard in the gym as much as I want to, then I usually go up to eights and that's kind of what happens around the holidays because there's candy and food and stuff. So anyway, maybe I will stick with the sixes, but right now they are like kind of tight right here. Um, but I think that they will obviously loosen up if 
I wear them for a while because I have the other mom jeans, the curvy mom jeans that I wear literally all the time and um, I really love them but I also have a black pair of mom jeans that look very similar and I thought that they would fit the same but they don't um, and they're black. So yeah, I don't know. I like how these fit a lot. These fit more like the lighter pair of jeans that I wear all the time, um, but they are a little tight. I can squat in them, but there isn't much room. I, I'm kind of like tight, can barely breathe. So um, I feel like an eight would fit a little bit better, but maybe these will stretch out. I They don't have an eight in the store, and so I'll probably order online and then see, and then if I like the eights better, I'll stick with the eights. If I like the six better, I'll stick with the six. Um, but yeah, these are really cute. Love them. I love how they're cropped at the bottom. Um, I think those are really cute. I honestly am loving this entire vibe for a full outfit. And uh, yeah, let me get into this coat so you guys can see what that looks like. Oh my god, y'all. This is so cute. Like, so freaking cute. It's very slick. Um, I really love it. If you guys um, are wanting to know what I'm going to put up on Saturday, it's going to be an H&M haul, by the way. Um, fun fact, just figuring to let you know, because even though this is the last item I'm trying on, um, I don't want you guys to think that it's over. Like, I literally am going to have another haul up in two days. Um, so yeah, this one's super cute. I really like it. I probably will not get it, just because, like, literally right when I put it on, I was just like, holy cow, this is a blue coat. Like when are you gonna wear blue like i barely even wear denim anymore um i wear a lot of like creams and neutrals and things so i don't think i would get enough wear out of this blue coat but it's so cute and i feel like with an all white look that could look really cute in the winter time but i got this in a medium i didn't size up i probably would size up to a large which is what i sized up um to with the corduroy t um corduroy coat whenever i purchased that last time i was in here but yeah really cute and it's like slick material I feel like I'm trying not to move so you guys don't hear the like sw little swishiness of it um, but yeah very cute very cropped and there's also like a hood in here that you can pull out so like when it's snowing and stuff you don't have to worry about like getting your hair like drenched or like you know makeup messed up or whatever so yeah very cute eee. All right, you guys, I found what I needed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will be uploading a video on Saturday about H&M. So I'll see you guys then. Bye.